What's up guys, my name is David from Zip DJ, and I'm excited to announce the release of our fully refreshed DJ record pool, Zip DJ V3. This time around, everything is updated and all new from the ground up to make it easier and more convenient for you to discover new music and fill your DJ sets with fresh tracks week after week. I'm excited to show you the inside, so let's go ahead and dive right in. Zip DJ has been completely reimagined from the ground up to help improve the music discovery process, including brand new interface, new advanced search capabilities, global chart data, and so much more. Today, let's take a quick look at all of the features that Zip DJ has to offer. When you log into Zip DJ, you land in the new releases tab. But before we get into these other pages, let's go ahead and review some of the elements that make up the interface. Across the header of the website, you have things like your advanced search bar, your genre filter, your download manager, and your account management tab. Now let's look at some of these pages over here. On the left hand side, we have our main navigation. We have home page, top downloads, top charts, zip DJ packs, labels, genres, and of course another downloads manager. When you log in, you land on your home page under new releases. Under the home page, you have a couple of different tabs. These are primarily where you're going to spend most of your time during your Zip DJ experience in music discovery. The new releases tab is the entire Zip DJ catalog, categorized by release date. You have a couple different ways to view this information, including the release view, which you land on, the track view, or the genre view. My favorite is the track view, so that's where I spend most of my time. In order to see more of what you're looking for, you can filter this page by genre. Here are some quick filters here so that I can filter this quickly by the urban genre. Under that, I can see that I have all of my urban genres here so that I can see the most up-to-date releases coming from Zip DJ every single day. I can reset those filters by clicking this reset filter button here. And of course, dive back into a different filter from the genre filter in the header. Let's go ahead and check out our Deep House catalog. Awesome. You may have noticed while filtering through some of these genres that this breadcrumb menu appeared. This is so that I can always see where I am during my navigation. And if I'd like, I can step backwards through the genre tree. So if I'm in Deep House, I can go ahead and click house and back out of there. Now I see all house. But if I want to, I can also click new releases and reset the genre totally. Now that we've seen some of the basic filtering capabilities of ZipDJ, let's jump to the top downloads page. As the name suggests, this page shows all of the top downloaded tracks from our community around the world. This, of course, can always be filtered by genre at any time, as well as going back in time from this week, last seven days, and so on. Before we move on, I want to show you one of my favorite things about the news of DJ. One of my favorite things about the news of DJ are the hotkeys. That allows me to navigate through the track section without ever having to touch the mouse, which is really convenient for getting through a lot of content all at one time. It makes it a breeze to use. For example, I can navigate up and down with my arrow keys and hit enter to play. From here, I can continue navigating, hit enter to play. I can use spacebar to pause and unpause. And I can use the right and left arrow keys to navigate through the tracks and play them at the same time. So I can get through a lot of previews in a short amount of time without ever having to use the mouse. That's the right arrow key, right arrow key. And now let's scroll down to this track here. Let's hit enter to play. Excellent. I can hold control and alt down on my keyboard and use the right and left arrow keys to scrub through the track. And even hit tab to send that track to my downloads batch. Awesome. Now let's hit spacebar. 
to pause that track and we can move on. Now let's take a minute to check out the trending charts. The trending charts are all new for ZipDJ v3. The trending charts compile global chart data into a single view and contain algorithms to help push new music to the top to help our DJs discover the best new music first. The trending charts are broken down into five different chart compilations that are a mixture of genre and data source. Here you can see we have an all compilation here, an airplay chart, an electronic chart, a mainstream chart, and of course, urban. Before we move on, I wanted to show you a few more neat things about the interface. If you've noticed down here in the track section, these little arrows next to the track names. If you go ahead and click on one of these arrows, you'll expand that track to see all the different versions of that mix that we have available in our database, from intros and outros to clean and dirty versions, as well as remixes. Furthermore, other things that are cool to check out down here are the fact that everything here is basically clickable. From the track name, to the artists, to the labels, and the genres. For example, if I go ahead and click on this artist's name, I'll go ahead and filter this view by this artist. So, if I see in the top left hand corner, I'm filtering by trending charts by this artist and I can see all of that information here. Neat. Now, if I wanted to look at it a different way, I can go ahead and click on something like a genre. If I click on that, now you'll notice I'm filtering by trending charts, genre house with a subgenre of house. And now I can see all that data here. Awesome. The last tab under our homepage is our top charts. These charts are compiled by our global DJ family, reported to us and delivered to you. We have dance, club, urban, and house charts available. Clicking on any one of these will drop down the different mixes of that track. Great. Now that we've gone through all the tabs under the homepage, let's go download some music. Downloading music couldn't be easier on ZipDJ. Let's head to the top downloads tab. Let's go ahead and grab some of these tracks from this list. As I hit this download button, you'll notice that I'm gonna be adding these tracks to my batch download. When I'm ready to download that batch, all I need to do is simply click on my downloads manager and download that batch. Or I can download these tracks individually as well. Easy. Before we go look at the rest of the pages on the website, let's go ahead and take a look at the advanced search. The advanced search can be found in the header of the website. In the advanced search, you can search for things like track names, artist names, remixes, labels, genres, and so much more. Let's go ahead and try it out. When I search for this artist, I get a result that shows me all of the artists that match that name with the most relevant one showing first, relevant tracks, relevant releases, and in the case of a label, labels would show as well. What's neat is I can go ahead and also click on that artist, and that will navigate over to the new releases page and filter by that artist so I can see the entire catalog that that artist has on the ZipDJ website. Very powerful. Let's go ahead and move on. Taking a look at some of the other pages we have on the system, let's navigate over to the ZipDJ Pack section. The ZipDJ Pack section is an entire library of curated music all ready to go for you. Inside here you can find different things between uh, urban genres, Latino genres, house genres, classic rock, and so much more. Here's a new series called Club Hits Reworked and it's been going really well. You should check it out once you get inside the system. Other pages we have over here to the left are things like labels, which allow you to come in here and look at content that are label specific, which is really, really great to see. Furthermore, we have genre pages. If you really wanna dive into specific subgenres, this is a great place to start. 
by jumping into a subgenre here, you get to see all the types of music that falls under that subgenre, including abilities to continue to dive into more specific subgenres. Really, really great. And then if I come down here, of course, I can take that genre if I like what I see, and I can go see all, which will navigate me back to the new releases page filtered by that genre. That's gonna go ahead and wrap up the basics of the Zip DJ system. We hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video and please comment if you have any more questions. We'd love to get them answered for you. Thanks so much, we'll see you next time.